Are you seeing more brown than green? Well, you're not alone, says Scott Barth of Extreme Landscaping and Lawn Care. A lot of the yards, they do look hot. Even people that have shallow wells looks like they're kind of struggling to keep up. But how do you keep up with maintaining a lush looking lawn? Barth talked turf with us. First of all, he says drought conditions aren't necessarily a bad thing for a lawn's health. It feels for water on its own versus uh, relying on a sprinkler system to go ahead and water for so it actually helps the lawn uh, get more established. Barth says as long as the grass is maintaining a shade of green, you're good. But if its color is anything but. The more water isn't necessarily the better. Over the years, he's seen many people water their lawns too much during excessive stretches of heat. Barth says all you really need is an inch of water per week. It's a more cost effective way to go, and so is installing a second water meter. Myrtle Beach spokesperson Mark Crua says 1,500 residences and businesses have them throughout the city. But the irrigation meter is just for that water that you use to water your grass, for example. Although the meter comes with a big price to install, It'll save you money in years ahead because you're not paying the sewer charge. You're saving about half the cost on your water and sewer bill with the irrigation only meter. 